And I'm not sure as fans you can fully comprehend what you as players are feeling after that. Can you help us? Can you sum up the emotions for us? Um, obviously usually disappointed with the result, but I think um, the endeavour and the turnaround was there uh, from last week. Um, you know, we were in it till the death. Um, obviously had an opportunity at the end. Um, I'm just very proud of the bunch, very conscious of what we represent and what everything means. But obviously hugely disappointed, like I said. Again, in that first half, you were kind of dominant. Momentum was with you. What, 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 was, what was going through your head at that stage? Um, you know, we wanted to come out after the second half, more of the same. I think we did that probably after the early exchanges. Um, and then, you know, the two and a throw of the penalties probably, you know, broke up the game. So, uh, probably similar to what we've seen in patches of previous games, but obviously, um, you know, trading those threes wasn't what we really wanted to do and we wanted to kick on. We couldn't necessarily do that. Um, there was frustration around the pace of the game last week. Do you feel the same tonight a little bit? Yeah, I think we did, but, um, you know, I, I know what the next couple of questions would probably be regarding. So, from, sometimes the integrity of the game, you don't say anything about those things and... Um, I like I say, just hugely disappointed in the way it panned out. And it was a brave call from Connor going for the line up there. Um, was it just a case of just feeling like you needed more than, than three points at that stage? Um, yeah, I think so. But I, we did the same in the first half, and you know we had we scored, but obviously we got done for getting ahead of the ball. Um, and obviously we scored in the first half, so you know it's a brave call. But we showed in games we, we could do that, and you know it's all hindsight now. Biggest regret from that 80. It's difficult um, at this stage to think about well, that. It's probably in the, in the immediate aftermath. I probably have to have a look at it. But like I say, huge proud, uh, pride uh, in, in what the guys um, put out there today to, to fall short. You know, on a, on a couple of calls is disappointing. Like I said. A few questions on you, Alan. I know you don't like talking about yourself, but you made it out here. Uh, the odds were against you. Despite the loss, how will you look back at this tour in comparison to, to the other three? Um, It's done now, so, um... now, this is your fourth Lions tour. I'm reluctant to say it's it's going to be your last, <laughs> given who I'm talking to. Um, you're going to sign off as a Lion great. If this is the last time that you put on that famous jersey, what will be your memories over the last 12 years? What does wearing that jersey mean to you? Oh, it's funny. I think this one in particular, I, I had to work uh, hard a second time to get out here, so... Um... I know a lot of these guys will be, be on the next one, so I look forward to watching them. Alan, well done. You've been fantastic, Larry. Like yes, Ride yourself.